the inventory is, is poorly kept. To update the inventory and establish an accurate one requires visiting each property in the town. There's 13,550 properties in this town. That's a huge task. Just to go around and, and just drive by 13,550 properties is a huge task. And to visit each one, measure it, get the square footage, uh, do an accurate inventory is is a large task. One that is really beyond the scope of the, the uh, assessor's office to do. I talked a little bit about the, the things we didn't understand about assessments. One of them was that I didn't understand the equalization rate. And I've, I've heard a lot of people since we began this talk about uh, things they think are unfair. When you mention equalization rate, people don't understand what that is. It is, uh, this information is all available on those websites, but the the equalization rate is the, the, the number the state gives you that says, here's, here's how we make your assessments fair across the state. So to get to full market value, you have to divide the assessed value in the town by the equalization rate. We'll talk a bit more about that as we move forward. Uh, this is from the, the website for ORCs, the uh, state. Office of the Real Property Services, and that's how they arrive at what the equalization rates are for towns across the state. And this, this is some equalization rates for other towns in the area. As you'll notice, Cicero and Clay are much lower in percentage, and that's because we are currently on partial value assessment. So the equalization rate is lower, which, which means that when you divide that out, you, have, you, you still can take your $5,000 and divide it by 4.9 and you'll come up with the, the market value of your property, or the assessed market value. So uh, to maintain the assessments in the town, we have on staff FTE is full-time equivalent. We have 13,550 parcels. We have a staff of three currently. Clay has 20,000. They have a staff of four and a half. Manlius and Salina are equivalently sized towns. They both have uh, more staff. Manlius with five, Salina with four. The state offers incentives for towns to go to full value assessment, assessment and to do a full revaluation of all properties. And they, they do that by paying $5 a parcel once the full revaluation is complete and the move to full value assessment. For the town of Cicero, that would be uh, $67,750. In addition to that, each year after that, that the town does a annual revaluation, they will get five dollars per parcel on state aid to uh, assist in keeping the roll current. Okay, so that's that's what we found out, and then from that we came up with some some recommendations. Uh, clearly, the assessor's role is is key to the whole process. If the assessor's office and uh, the people in that office aren't doing their job, then the assessments will not be uh, accurate and fair. The town people, the property owners, must have confidence in the assessor's office. Otherwise, we're going to have a whole bunch of grievances every year, which is counterproductive. The, the staffing level, uh, we think, is kind of low for the town given the number of parcels. Um, here's the thing that, that have to, the items that have to be attended to by the assessor's office. Uh, keeping the roll current is, uh, is paramount.